so today is Saturday. It is 1014 in the morning. Shakira and I, we are about to go to Soda City Market downtown. It's so crazy. I've been staying in Columbia for years and never went to the Soda City Market. My goal is to find some flowers there because every time I would drive by, I saw like beautiful flower arrangement and there's like so many different vendors. So once we're done with that, I do have a couple more errands to run. I need to go to the grocery store, I need to go to Target. And if I don't find any flowers that I like at Soda City Market, I'll go ahead and get my flowers from Trader Joe's. Um, Cause generally I just, when I was making my flower arrangements, I would get them from Trader Joe's. So. That is the agenda so far for today. I do have a meeting at 2.30 that I need to be somewhere. So I'm gonna try to get as much stuff done as possible. When I go to the grocery store, I may just do that after the meeting because I don't think I'll have time to run home, drop the groceries off, put the groceries up, and get across town by 2.30. So we'll see, but let's go. I want um, what? one of those watermelons. <laughs> So these are the flowers. They have all different types of bouquet of flowers. Thank you very much. Thank you. Oh, let's go this way. What is it? Hey, may I get your original? Thank you so much. Thank you, sir. Yes, sir. Okay. Thank you, sir. Thank you. So, I'm going to just get one of these. So, what kind of this one? Rum peach cobbler. Rum peach cobbler? Mm -hmm. Do you have a Strawberry lemonade, rum peach cobbler, red velvet, uh, vanilla, and chocolate. Okay, and they're how much? Eight Slices a piece? of 12 and 12? Uh, once or eight. Okay, so may I get one of these? Mm -hmm. And then which one is this? Vanilla. Okay, uh, may I get this one? Okay. You want anything? Get one for you, Grandma. And I know you didn't read my signs. All my cakes are vegan. I know, that's why I came. <laughs> yeah. Yes, ma'am. Okay. Good morning. Thank you. It is. Well, it's going to be 9 degrees today. It's going to be what? Like 9. You vlog on today? Yeah. Y'all have a That's good one. Don't, don't do your time. Out here. Oh, try not to. Thank you for your time. All right. All right, y'all. So right now we are at Starbucks. Um, I just needed to get something to drink and just a little, um, a little croissant or something because I have not had anything to eat. Um, my mom, she has both of my base at her place so I'm about to take my dad his peanuts take my mom one of those cakes and pick up my base but I'll show y'all the flowers in detail once I actually get in the base but this is it here and I mean I feel like it's a really good size for $30 but this is the first time I, but this is the first time I ever actually um, bought flowers that was already made generally I make my own flowers so I guess I'll have to compare the flowers that I got here versus like if I were to do it myself but that is about it so next I need to go just try to time everything right because I got an appointment at 2 30 and technically it's on this side kind of like this side of town so to go back home would kind of make no sense but I can go ahead and go by Target and get at least the things that we need from Target. 
And then by that time, I'd probably call the company to see if I can push it up. But yeah, I don't think I showed you guys my watch since I resized it. If y'all saw my last vlog, you know that I went to Nordstrom and I got this Anne Klein watch. However, it was big. So like now, it's been resized to my wrist. So I absolutely love it. But I'll talk to y'all in a little bit. so it is the next day today is september the first so i started off september i feel like in a good way so i got up i went ahead and i fixed breakfast i did a workout and now it is 2 22 and shakira and i were about to go to the movies um i think she was saying that she wants to see this is us or all of us i'm not for sure the name of the movie but um we are supposed to go there at it starts at three o'clock so i'm guessing we're gonna leave the house um any minute now but i just wanted to show you guys the outfit i absolutely love this shirt i feel like i'm gonna start wearing oversized shirts because i absolutely love it love it i got this one from nordstrom um if y'all saw my last video that's when i bought it and i am just pairing it with my ann klein watch and my coach ring uh, my hairstyle just have it slicked back because i need to get my hair done but I don't know because I've been, I'm trying to start back working out. So I feel like if I work out, get a silk press, I'm not really going to be able to enjoy it. So although, yes, I'm getting my hair treated and things of that nature, I still don't want to be wasting money by getting a silk press and not able to enjoy it. So I need to figure out a way that I'm able to, what I'm able to do, like what kind of hairstyle I'm able to do versus just always putting extensions in it but yes so when i get back home either i'm gonna meal prep today or i'm gonna start meal prepping tomorrow because like i said i want to start off september intentional um monday of course you know we're all for the holiday however tuesday when i start back i'll be starting my new role so i just want to make sure that i'm i, I want to start treating work like how i used to treat going to school back in the day i don't know if y'all kind of um took out your outfits for the whole week so you knew what you were going to wear for the week right so that's what i want to do i'm not an early morning person and it takes time to kind of change your mind and like change your mindset and things of that nature so i'm like okay what can i do to help me get up early in the morning work out and still be able to log into work on time and to be proactive proactive as far as making sure I set everything up so that way I can be productive throughout the day so I said Tara why don't you incorporate your school setting when you were in high school middle school to your nine to five or to like kind of like your everyday right so what I'm going to do is I'm going to take out an outfit for Tuesday through Friday because although I'm working from home I truly feel like the better you look the better you do 
that's just for me like when I'm actually dressed and if I have to like go out for an errands I feel good I don't have to look for anything I'm not taking away from my lunch break because you know we don't get that long of a lunch break so I'm not taking away from it I have my clothes on I look nice I can go out run my errand come back home and I'm still in good time versus having on my nightgown my whole entire shift you know it's just it just doesn't work well for me i've noticed and also too since i want to continue to work out i'm gonna start taking out my gym clothes i'm gonna go ahead and section out my gym clothes so i know hey tar when 6 30 come you pick one of those sets whatever set you want to pick and then you go to the gym so that way it's like i have everything right where i need it so that so that way it's like you don't have any excuse at this point you have no excuse but yeah outfit of the day i love it um i don't know what bag i'll wear I'm not for sure but i'll show y'all that later but i'll talk to y'all in a little bit but i burned this candle last night and this morning and y'all oh my gosh when i tell y'all i used to dislike candles so much but i love this candle i love candles i don't know i am a candle woman now but yeah talk to y'all a little bit yeah this is better all right so i'm about to open up my computer for work <sighs> Like I was telling y'all, I started my I will start my new role on tomorrow, Tuesday, the third. So they sent my computer last Wednesday. So I just need to open it and connect everything up to the Wi-Fi. If y'all saw my other video, I was telling y'all that. I still work in clinical research it's just I have another role so although my title has changed from a CRA to a site monitor I'm still monitoring um, like the clinical trial I just to my understanding right now I won't have to travel out as much a lot of the core of my previous videos have been me traveling to different cities different states and I was taking you know I was recording it I was taking everybody with me however now I shouldn't be traveling as much so since I kind of don't know the schedule that's why I went ahead and I'm meal prepping for the week so that way that's one less thing I would have to do and also you know TJ he's homeschooled he goes to school from home as well so if I'm tired from being on work from nine to five of course i wouldn't want him to have to go to school and then worry about cooking and i'm not pretty much a leftover person so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna cook enough food for today monday tuesday and then wednesday i'll cook something else for thursday and friday laptop my other work laptop over there is a ThinkPad as well so yeah so I'm still with the same company I'm still with the same company however I applied for a role within their um, single sponsor department so even though I work for a clinical research organization we have different pharmaceutical companies that of course is within the company right so if you're like full of service if you get onto a study you may have three sponsors that you're working for however like I said now I'm only working with one particular sponsor which 
I feel like I would love because I'm able to understand their core values. I'm able to understand kind of how they want things to be. And, it, and I feel like it makes things a little bit easier because you, you know what that, what that sponsor want, what that sponsor is looking for. So this is the computer. I'm gonna just go ahead and charge it. So when I attach it to my Wi-Fi, it'll be charged. Earlier today, y'all saw I went to the gym and I have another gym session at 6.30. So my personal gym was just now and then I'm gonna go to 6.30 to martial arts. If y'all been around, y'all know I do. I've, I'm off and on with martial arts. But um, martial arts at 6.30 to 8.30. So I have that today because today is Monday. So I'm just cooking everything over there in the kitchen. Right now I have cabbage, beef neck bones, um, rice cooking, chicken cooking, and then I'll do like two more other things just to make sure it's enough food for today and Tuesday. And then like I said, we'll figure out what we're gonna do for Wednesday and Thursday, but I'll talk to y'all a little bit. All right, y'all, so I am on a little lunch break. I just ran out, I placed my lunch order, and I also went ahead and placed a Target order for pickup, so that way, once I'm done with work today, I can just go ahead and it can be ready for me. In a perfect scenario, it will be ready for me now, and I can just go ahead and pick it up, and I'll be done. I don't even have to worry about doing that um, once I get off of work. But um, I went ahead, ordered my lunch. Today has been going pretty well. Like I told you guys, today is my first day of my new role. So it's just like typical new hire um, day. I have a lot of trainings that I have to do. Um, I had to set up my computer. I had to set up my email. I had to set up my um, phone. I had to set up all that stuff. So it's just a lot of training and a lot of admin work, I would say. But um, besides that, everything's good. I have a meeting at 2 o'clock, so that's why I'm trying to go ahead and get something to eat and then get back. I already cooked dinner for tonight. Y'all have so many moving parts. Oh my gosh, when you're working, when you're a mom, whew, it's a lot that you got to do. And plus, make sure that you do some things for yourself. And I have to be at the gym at 6 o'clock. So gym from 6 to 7, work from 9 to 5, and then 5 to 6 or good five to I'll probably leave at like 545 because the gym's not too far from my house if TJ's ready to eat him and I will go ahead and eat because I at least want to make sure I eat with him before I go to the gym because generally he is lights out at nine o'clock because I need to make sure that he's well prepared for the morning so by the time I get back from the gym it'll probably be about 7 30 so I doubt he's going to want to eat that late. But if he wants to, then we can eat at that time. But yeah, y'all. The day and life of being a mom, working and doing all that stuff. But I'm about to run in here and get my food. And then I'll talk to y'all a little bit later after work. All right, y'all. So it's the end of the work day. Um, today, like I told you guys, was my first day on this particular study. So the only thing that I was doing today was a lot of training, a lot of training. Um, I'm still trying to get the computer up and running. It's been setting up for the last six hours. So if that does not, if it's not done by the time I come back from the gym, I'm gonna have to give IT a call because generally it takes two to four hours and it's been good six to seven hours right now and it's stuck at the same, um, is stuck at the same screen so I went to Starbucks got me a grande size ice apple non dairy chai and I also while I was out I got the same ingredients that Starbucks use now the only thing different is I don't know the kind of chai so that was the difference um, in the chai and of course it's a non dairy chai so that's gonna make or break it however I went on TikTok and I saw different people cre recreating the drink. And I'm like, okay, this drink right here cost me $6. I'm not spending $6 every day for a drink. I have, and I feel like that's just insane. So I went ahead, I bought the apple syrup. I have some caramel drizzle. I have the same Oatly oat milk. And the only difference is I have that chai. 
So I also said before I actually start making it, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to Starbucks, order a drink again, and see exactly what they're using. So I saw they did the Oatly. I don't know if this is the same apple syrup or not because obviously that'll make or break it too. However, we're just going to see and then we're just going to swing it and just go by that. Um, I didn't show y'all my flowers. So these are the flowers that I got when I was at... Soda City Market this past weekend and this is it in the vase so I showed you guys kind of like a glimpse of it but I just never showed it to you in the vase so yeah this is how it looks in the vase I absolutely love it but yeah y'all that is about it I'm going to end the vlog here today is Tuesday I'm just going to finish the rest of the week and then I'll start back off my new vlog on on Friday Friday Saturday on uh, one of those days. So yeah, I'll talk to you guys later and I hope you have a good day. A good night.